In today's Builders tutorial, we're going to walk through how to connect your FormSec forms to your favorite Microsoft products. With the Microsoft Power Automate Connector, anyone on your team can automate tasks and send critical data to your central business systems. Today, we're going to walk through how to connect your FormSec forms to Microsoft Dynamics, Microsoft SharePoint, Microsoft OneDrive, Microsoft Teams, and Microsoft Excel. First, let's look at how we could use a lead capture form from FormStack to create a new record in Microsoft Dynamics. To get started, log into your FormStack Forms account and build your form. For this example, we're building a simple lead capture form. If you're not sure where to get started, check out the templates on our site at formstack.com backslash templates. We offer hundreds of templates to help you hit the ground running. Once your form is ready, log into Power Automate. Choose Connectors and search for the FormStack connector. Next, you'll be prompted to authenticate your account. Once your account has been authenticated, a list of the FormStack forms in your account will appear. Choose the form you'd like to connect to Microsoft Dynamics. Search for and select the Microsoft Dynamics app. Next, you'll be prompted to choose your organization name and select which entity or object you'd like to create. For this example, we're choosing to create a contact. You'll need to set up a one-to-one -one mapping of your form fields to the fields on your Microsoft Dynamics record. Once you've mapped your fields, you can test your new flow by adding sample data to your form and making sure your new record is created in your Microsoft Dynamics account. Once the form data has been submitted, we searched our account under M to confirm that our sample customer, Mary Swanson, was successfully added. Next, we'll use a form to create a line on a table in Microsoft Excel. On the Create tab, choose the Automated Cloud Flow option. Choose Form Submission as your trigger and select your form. In this example, we're using an alumni donation form. Next, you'll need to provide the location, document library, file, and table that you want to populate with your form data. Map your fields, hit Save, and run a test. Here we're adding test data to our form, which will automatically populate a receipt for our contributors. If you'd like to learn more about setting up donation workflows with FormStack, check out the link in the upper right-hand corner. Once we've submitted our test data, we'll check our Excel document to make sure the submission populated correctly. For our next walkthrough, let's look at how you'd connect a FormStack form to your Microsoft Teams account. From the My Flows tab, select New Flow. Choose Automated Cloud Flow. Give your flow a name, choose the form stack connector, and set your trigger. Choose the form you'd like to connect to your Teams account. Here, you can use form fields to customize and personalize the message that comes through your Teams account. Once again, we're ready to test our workflow by adding sample data to our form. Once you hit submit, head over to your Teams account to make sure your message successfully sent. Next, let's look at how you can upload files to OneDrive using a FormStack form. In this example, we're using a form where employees need to upload their certificates of completion for annual compliance training. Again, we're going to choose New Flow and set Form Submission as our trigger. Choose the form you'd like to use and select the OneDrive app. Choose Create File from the list of actions. Choose the folder where you'd like your document to be saved and choose a naming convention. Here, we're using first name, last name to identify the documents. Choose the fields with the documents you'd like to upload and hit Save. Open your form and add sample data to run a test. Then check your OneDrive account to make sure your documents were added. For our final flow, we're going to look at how to upload a document using a FormStack form to your SharePoint account. Just like in the other examples, head over to the Power Automate connector and choose New Flow and set Form Submission as your trigger. Next, choose the SharePoint app and set your action as Create a File in SharePoint. Choose the SharePoint folder where you'd like to save your file, give your file a name, and map your fields. Run a final test by adding sample data to your form and log into your SharePoint account to ensure your documents were uploaded correctly. With FormStack and Microsoft, it's easy to automate the boring stuff and focus on critical work that powers your business. 
Test any of these automated workflows today with a 14-day free trial, or check out the other videos in our Builder series for more ways to automate your organization.